So I'm here working with the Chinawataka Women's Initiative, working with women in the slum areas of Chinawataka to earn an income so that we can empower women who are in this community. The main thing we are doing is recycling used drinking straws into um, environmentally friendly reusable products that help the environment throughout here because plastic is kind of thrown all over the street. Um, it clogs drains, animals eat it, it's a pretty big issue. This big trash pile is one of many that are in Mboya in Chinawantika slum area. Um, unfortunately, garbage collection is a big issue and people often put them into big piles like this and then burn them. Or in small piles just on the road, you'll see big black spots where they burn it at night. And often you will see these piles that are on fire and you'll be breathing in the smoke and kids will be playing right by. It's a big issue. In the piles, some are organic things that will actually biodegrade, but there's a lot of plastic too. Some plastic straws and bags and all sorts of things that are just not going to go away. The ground here is covered in plastic bags like these. They just blend in, but they're all over the place. There's some more plastic bags. They're just part of the roadway um, here in Chinawatsika. As much as there's dirt, there's plastic bags. And Chinawatsika got its name because it means the earth. It means the dirt. And it's kind of sad to see that uh, the dirt is no longer on its own. It's now Chinawatsika and plastic. Yeah, so our big plan is to try to address plastic waste in particular, that's in Chinawatsika, to try to um, collect straws in the community and then make them into reusable bags which will be distributed in five of the local stores here. The idea with this is that if we distribute these bags, they will use these reusable durable bags instead of plastic. And we can reduce the amount of plastic bags in Chinawatsika by 100,000 over the next year. So this bag here is one of our small shopping bags. It's actually one of the bags that we'll be distributing, a sample of one, we'll be distributing throughout Chinawatsika markets in 2015. And we're going to give out 400 of these bags, which are made out of recycled drinking straws that come from around Kampala and are... Um, they're washed, they're woven, and sewn together by women in the Chinawatsika community. This is the Mbuya Shopping Center in Chinawatsika. Um, it is one of the two stores that participated in our pilot program of the bag distribution back in 2012. And they are the largest store in Chinawatsika. And they're really excited to work with us going forward. We have a great relationship with the store owner and she's really excited about the um, bag distribution. In addition to helping the environment, you're also giving women in the community an income as they are producing these bags. We're making great progress. Um, it's really exciting to see the uh, change happening in the community and be able to um, support the people in Chinawatika and improve sanitation and their livelihoods. I've really grown a lot personally and professionally through this Peace Fellowship with the Advocacy Project and I'm excited to have a way to contribute to people's lives in Uganda.